Hi, this is Tanya with Armchair Sniffer. I am creating this channel just to have like a lighthearted, casual approach to fragrance reviews. And I've been collecting fragrances for over 20 years and just wanted to show you a few of my favorite green floral slash woody aromatics. Um, I started off basically in 1995 uh, with Bath & Body Works Juniper Breeze as one of my favorites. And I normally layer this with other perfumes. And in fact, one of my favorite um, perfume oil companies is Black Phoenix Alchemy Lab. And Black Forest is a beautiful green, woodsy fragrance um, full of fir, juniper, uh, wild floral notes, and um, ambergris. And this, it gets better as it gets older. Uh, for whatever reason, perfume oil, it lasts a long time and the notes get richer. And I really, really enjoy this one. Another one that I enjoy of the green notes would be from the German company 4711, Awakening Woods of Scandinavia. And this is like a crisp early morning when the dew's rising and it's cold, refreshing, and I, I really adore this fragrance. Um, the green notes are very fresh and zesty and you can't go wrong with it. It's a beautiful, beautiful cologne that anybody can enjoy. And it lasts a good three to four hours. Uh, another one that's really good is um, one that is named after a Roman garden called Ninfeo Mio by Anique Goutal. And this is a gorgeous, gorgeous um, aromatic. It opens up with a bright uh, bergamot and then dries down into a woody fig tree. And it is just absolutely gorgeous. If I ever get a chance to go to Rome, I would love to go to the garden Ninfeo Mio and really, really enjoy it. I especially enjoy that in the spring and in the summer. It's really nice and refreshing. One of my favorite um, independent houses is Happy Land Studio, and they have one fragrance called Gaelic Mist. And if you're familiar with the smell of the original Irish Spring bar soap, this is that, but richer and fuller and this is a beast of a fragrance. One or two sprays on the pulse points is all you need. It lasts all day and I can't get enough of it. And it's just wonderful and fresh and fresh. Another one, it's my favorite of the green fragrances is Chanel number no. 19, the EDT formulation. And supposedly this was Coco Chanel's favorite perfume. I don't know if it was, but I know it's one of my favorites. Um, it's not really a strong floral uh, fragrance. It's more of the green parts of the flower, the stems. It's almost as if you cut the stems and the leaves off of a flower. And it's clean, fresh, and cooling. I especially adore this during the springtime and the summer, especially when it's really, really warm. But then in the fall and winter, I will transition over to the stronger formulation of Chanel number no. 19, the EDP. And it is just absolutely gorgeous as well. And there's another flanker of Chanel number no. 19 that I adore. It is the Chanel number no. 19 Poudre. And this is supposed to be an interpretation of a powder form of Chanel number no. 19 with an iris and orris root note. And it does it hit that spot on with the, uh, the orris and iris and it's beautiful. Unfortunately, it only lasts about 30 minutes, but I really, really do enjoy it. Um, if you enjoy number no. 19, which I adore, there is a more economical version that I discovered years ago called, and I think it's a Spanish company, Silences by Giacomo. And this smells like the Chanel number no. 19 EDP version, but stronger. And it lasts for hours, and I love it. Um, in fact, that's what I'm wearing today. I uh, endure this year-round, 
and my last green floral slash woody landscape type perfume is from the House of Zoologist. And I absolutely love the presentation of their box. This is Snowy Owl. And this is a gorgeous, gorgeous creation. It emulates the woods on a, small, a, a snowy morning. Uh, excuse me, a snowy morning. And uh, I don't know how they captured it, but you smell the snow and you smell the woods and you just want to escape into this, this beautiful fragrance. Um, this is just a quick little casual recap or review of green florals and landscape uh, aromatics that I have in my collection. Just wanted to share and I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks. Goodbye.